Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. Today, we're taking Luton into the Premier League on FIFA 23, and I'm gonna have 10 minutes of a transfer window to try and get a few players in. We're gonna sim a season and see how we get on. I have no idea if 10 minutes is gonna be enough time. It's gonna be a tricky one. I've given myself a budget of 40 million. Now, a lot of people might think that's way too much, but actually, if you look at the, the teams that have been promoted over the years, some of them have spent over 100 million, 150 million. It's an incredible amount of money. So I think 40 is actually a little bit on the low side, but we're gonna try our best to at least keep Luton in the Premier League. Now, I've literally, gone into the career mode. I've recalled all of the players that are out on loan. I've cancelled all the loans that I had because, of course, I'm using last season's squads. And that's all I've done. Literally all I've done. I haven't even looked into the team properly. And I'm about, I'm about to start the timer. I'm going to have 10 minutes to just go for it. Sign as many good players as I can. I'm not just going to sign anyone. I'm not going to be blowing money on loads of free agents. No. We are going to try and do this somewhat realistically slash properly, maybe a few loans. So without further ado, are we ready to go? I think so. We are going to go ahead and start the timer in three, two, one, go. All right, 10 minutes on the clock. What do I want to do? Well, first of all, I know they're linked with drama. I've already gone into the wrong tab. They are linked with bringing drama or drama back from Leeds. So let's go ahead and try and see if we can get him permanently. He was on loan there last season. He was one of their best players. Um, we're going to go ahead and shortlist him and instantly put in an offer to buy. I'm going to up this a little bit just because I really don't want this one to fail. I'm going to go up to 5 million for him. That should be more than enough. So that's the first thing I wanted to get done that is out of the way and we've used almost a whole minute. Okay. What positions do we need to improve? I'm thinking goalkeeper, centre back. The, the midfield is okay, but maybe a, a CDM or a central midfielder. Striker wise, I think we're okay. Um, okay. I really need to think here. Who could I get in goal? I need someone... I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to look in the Premier League. I think it's it's not unrealistic to do that. Um, Premier League, we're going to look at goalkeepers over the age of, let's say, 28. And let's see who maybe we could get. Um, oh, God. Jack Butland's gone to Celtic, hasn't he, in real life? Um, Fabianski. Oh my God, this is actually a little bit more tricky than I thought because the time just disappears. Oh, Carius. Hello. Carius could be decent. Um, Ortega. I don't think we can afford any of these guys. Hmm. Um, Turner wouldn't be bad, but very high wages. Steel. Mm, do you know what? I'm quite happy with the choice I've already gone with there. Let's see if we can get Carrius in. I don't know how much his wages are. I think we wait. We wait. We need to make sure we get wages. So that's goalkeeper option. Central midfield. I think I go for a really solid loan here. I think if we can find like a, a DM from a top Premier League club that I can just loan in. Uh, let's just bring the age down a little bit. We'll go to a maximum of kind of 23, 18 to 23. Caicedo, yeah, all right. Ghana, yeah, could potentially be a good choice. I might look in the, um, ooh, Lokonga. Oh, he's on loan, isn't he? I could look into the championship as well. Let's just have a quick look. I think to save time, I might just stay in England because it is going to be a little bit easier. As you can see, I've moved Leeds and the other teams that have been um, relegated into that league. Oh, Diallo. Now that would be an incredible signing. I might try and get him. Um, hmm. Tyler Morton. I think he's, yeah, he's a, he's a future potential star, isn't he? But he's on loan. Oh my God, Sumer. I can't believe Leicester are in the championship. Let's have a look at central midfielders as well. Uh, Aziz. No, I'm good. Uh, Jewsbury Hall, hello. That could be incredible. Gabby Ogbonglahor would be would be very happy right now. <laughs> if you know, you know. 
Um, what else do we have here? There's just so many. So many. I'm a big fan of Lauser. Loser. He could be good. Uh, McKenny. That's not going to happen. Alex Scott would be oh, incredible. What a signing that could be. I think that's a good amount. We've got six minutes, 10 seconds-ish. Um, do I look at strikers or do I just... I think we go with what we've got for now. Have I got any of their stats? No. So we need to just make sure they're all being scouted. Scouting, scouting. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're good. Okay. So now we're going to go forward a few days. I have got the training mod. They're going to get A's every time. Uh... 3.3 million to get drama, drama, I think it's drama, right? We'll go ahead and accept that. I'm going to delegate his wage and I'm just going to bump it up a little bit just again to make sure he's at Leeds. It's a relatively high wage, 4,100. Actually, that's not that high. I think I'm overpaying on the wage there. Oops, that is the problem when you're under pressure. And there it is. Of course, he's accepted it and he's taken 15. Could have got more, mate, if I'm honest. Oh, I have to Yep, just keep moving. Keep moving. We don't need to watch the uh, the cutscenes here. Although, how do I get the thumbnail? <laughs> right, so I have massively overpaid there. But you know what? That's going to happen. It's just going to happen. Let's go ahead and put Clark on the bench and bring Drame back in. So we've signed him permanently. That is perfect. Did I look at centre-backs? I didn't. Okay, we'll, we'll come back to that. We've, we've used half our time. This is this is okay. We've got a loan offer for Pebble. Pep, Pebble, what a name. Um, I'm going to delegate it with just a loan for one year um, and a two-year loan for Taylor. Yep, yeah, that's fine by me. I haven't really had any big offers come in, though, which is a shame. I have got players up for sale. I'm Well, I'm hoping that I'll get some offers because I've... Got a lot of players is what I'm trying to say. We've got a lot of scout reports back now. That is good news. Can we sign any of these guys? I think goalkeeper is going to be absolutely vital. So Karius is 72 rated. Oh my God, he's cheap. So cheap. Okay, I want Dewsbury Hall. I'm going to go ahead and delegate this. I'm going to try 12 to 18. He would be a big chunk of my budget. I'm going to go for Alex Scott as well. Um, delegate to buy. He would be a lot more. So for the sake of realism, I'm actually going to offer more. I don't know how much he would be, but he's a bit of a gem, isn't he? So we'll go 7 to 10. And then I think Karius is, is actually a pretty good choice. High on the wage, but 72 rated. That's going to be the difference. Is there any I could loan? Any goalkeepers off the top of my head? I don't think so. Oh, I'm just going to go for it. Unless I could loan him? Delegate to loan? Ooh. They might accept it. Okay. Uh, Centre-backs. Oh, I'm running out of time. I am running out of time. Let's go back to maybe the Premier League for this. Maybe I can loan in a top-level centre-back that's at one of the top clubs. Ooh, Chalaba. That could work very nicely. Uh, Totti Gomez. He's very decent. Is there anyone realistic here? Mm, maybe not. Van Heck, I like him. He's good. Saw him playing a few times for Brighton. Um, I might go for Totti Gomez, but I don't know how high rated he is. That could be a problem. Um, okay, let's just add him to the list. And Chalaba, why not? Just add him to the list as well. All right, so we've got two and a half minutes left. Now, if there's any deals that haven't gone through, they don't count. I have to get them into the team. So we're paying seven million for Scott. That's fine by me. Delegate that. Just bump up the wage a little bit just to make sure we actually get him. We're waiting on Dewsbury Hall. I really need to speed up here. I think I'm, I'm doing this a little bit too slowly. We've got a loan agreement. Okay. Uh, transfer offer for Musque. Okay, that's fine. Oh my god, the, all the emails. It really slows you down. I'm guessing this is a player leaving. Yep, don't care. Skip, please. Let me skip. I'm running out of time. Yep, that's fine. I don't think I'm going to have time to make any other sales. Right, that's good. Scott in. I don't want the 
cutscene. Skip, skip, skip. How much time? Oh, no. Guys, the cutscenes are going to kill me. I'm not going to get a center back in, am I? Bad negotiation. Yeah, no, no. Yeah, no S word. Carious. Uh, accept. Delegate. Yeah, just big signing. Okay, come on, please, 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 please. If I don't get a keeper in, I'm going to be really worried. I think Carrius might say no. Okay, it's another player leaving. We've got just over a minute. I am stressing right now. I don't know how we're going to survive the league. The team is not high enough rated as it is. But good news, Carrius has accepted. We've signed a Champions League legend. <laughs> And he replaces... Well, I haven't got any goalkeepers above 70 rated. They had one on loan, but obviously he's gone. Good news again. Jewsbury Hall accepted. So that's four signings. I just need a centre-back and I've only got 40 seconds. Totti is... I'm just going to have to go for it. And I'm going to go into the negotiations myself. Okay, back out, back out, back out, back out. I have no idea if he's going to be good enough, guys. I'm just going to go for it. Um, where are you? Oh, do I go... I'll go Chalaba. Approach to buy. Oh, no, this isn't going to happen. Uh, I haven't used any of the money, apparently. Oh, yeah, I have. Wait, no, I haven't. Oh, whatever, 20 mil, just take it. Oh, I don't think this should count. I don't know what's happened now. I think it's the mod. Uh, okay, I'm just going to chuck in a amount of money. Yeah, 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 yeah. Does this count? No. And that is the end of my time. I don't think Chalaba counts, guys. Damn it. Out of interest, would I have got the deal done? Let's have a look. Chalaba offer accepted. Damn. So what's happened to the, the wage? Uh, the Yeah, okay. So I think it has just bugged out. So we will not count Chalaba. Um, okay, if we go into transfer history, we can total up how much we've spent and then we'll see if I've gone over. If I've gone over 40, then obviously I've done this wrong. So... I think we're fine. Dewsbury Hall, yeah, we are absolutely fine. I probably could afford to get Chalaber in, but we're not going to. I failed. I ran out of time, so we're going to go ahead and reject it. But we got in Drame, Scott, Dewsbury Hall, and Carius. <laughs> um, not great. Now, what I will do is probably just sim the season and accept any offers I get for players that I'm not going to be using. So we'll, we'll just let them go if they want to. But let's go ahead and put them into the team now. So we're going to stick with this formation. It seems to be working quite well for them in real life. So why would I change it? Carius is going in goal. And of course, my defence, not the strongest, but it will do. Okay. Bell at left wing back. He is a centre back. He loses a little bit of... He's not in his correct position, so he has lost a little bit of his stats. Or, you know, he's not getting a bonus, basically. Uh, I'm going to put Dewsbury Hall and Scott into the team. I'm just going to move Dewsbury Hall forward into that centre mid role. And I think we're going to play Mpanzu in the middle. Legend of the club. So, in terms of the bench, we've got Woodrow. Don't really need a left wing. I don't think this is actually going to matter. But do you know what? I'm relatively happy with that. We have got, effectively, 70 rated players in every position. It's just Rame, and he, he will grow. But I think Scott and Panzu and Jewsbury Hall, 77 rated. That is an absolute steal. Really, really happy with that. So, we are going to go ahead and sim the season now. <sighs> this is going to be an interesting one. Can I even remotely, closely keep them in the league Let's go to the end of December and see what happens. I've just got a feeling that I'm going to get sacked very quickly if I don't win games. So it's Wolves up first. Let's see. We've lost. Good start. We're going away to Everton. We've won. Okay. We've won in the cup as well. We could go on a nice little cup run. Okay. And a draw. I'm quite surprised. I thought I was going to have all losses, but we've lost to Brentford up against the Irons next. Or the hammers, and we've lost that. We've lost that. We've lost that. Yeah, mm hmm. Yep, yeah, we've lost another one. <laughs> Guys, I don't know if it's possible. Oh, we've beaten Nottingham Forest, fellow relegation potential rivals. Um, we've lost a couple others there United and Tottenham. We've lost to Villa. Uh, I don't know. I don't. Oh, we've lost to Burnley as well. We needed to win that one. 
beaten Palace 3 0, though. Hello. Didn't get to see the other result. We've beaten Fulham 3 1. Do you know what? We might not be bottom here. Obviously, we've lost to Chelsea. Obviously, we lost to Newcastle. We drew against City. Lost to Arsenal. Lost to City. Okay. Predictions. I'm going to guess I am 19th. That's my prediction. So we've got a thumbs up from the board at the moment. Let's have a look at the league table. 19th. I, I, I guessed it. So Bournemouth are the only team doing worse than us, but we're only one point off West Ham. How are West Ham so low down? And then at the top, we've got Man City. Spurs always seem to do well when I sim. Liverpool and then Arsenal. So as we are just over halfway, let's go ahead and see how the squad is doing in terms of stats. Karras has played nine times. What? Why? That makes no sense. Which goalkeeper is playing the most games then? Wait. I'm so confused right now. They are just sharing the love. Why? Why did I bother signing him then? <laughs> Top scorer is Adebayo. Okay, Scott, what a signing. Six goals, three assists. Morris, five goals from his 17 appearances. That's pretty poor, to be honest. Hmm. Um, top creator, Scott, Dewsbury Hall. What a signing, though. He's up to 78 rated now. But I'm very, very impressed with Scott. And how much are these guys worth now? Obviously, I overpaid quite a bit on one or two of them. But Dewsbury Hall's up 38%. 16% for Scott. Nice. Do you know what? I'm actually happy. I, I don't think it's going too badly. I reckon we can get out of the relegation zone if we have a bit of luck. But as you can see, Drama is now 70 rated, so the team is fully 70 rated or more. But you can't tell me that that squad right there would survive relegation. I just don't think it would. It's just not, um, it's not strong enough. So now we're going to go towards the end of the season. What's going to happen here? No, we're not playing a game, by the way. We are just simulating the season to see how my 10 minute window helped. As of right now, I can't tell if 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 it's better than it would have been. I, I have a feeling we would be 20th. I just don't think the squad is anywhere near as good as Burnley and Sheffield United, who came up as well. It's another month without a win there. Oh, dear. I mean, I don't think we'll get sacked because they were still relatively happy with me, despite being in 19th. Another month goes by without a green box, without a dub. Another one looks like we're going without another win here. Yep. So we haven't won a game since December. Thumbs up from me. <laughs> and it's a win against Nottingham Forest. We've done a double over them. And a draw against Bournemouth. That could be huge. That could be huge, guys. Did we beat Burnley there? I need to check. I need to check. No, we didn't beat Burnley. Okay. This is it. Four games to go. Let's just see where we are. Oh, no. I'm going to get sacked. We're still 19th. Yeah, guys, it is done. There's no chance we're catching up. Are we even going to make it to the end of the season? Nope. <laughs> Contract termination. What a surprise. Isn't that weird? I didn't think I'd, I'd get sacked because we were obviously going to perform at a very high level. <laughs> but that is it. Unfortunately, guys, we are not going to keep them in the league and we're not going to keep our job. But I enjoyed the 10 minute window. Let's just see what happens as we get towards the end of this season. Let's just go ahead and sim to the end and uh, we'll check their stats again. Let's see how I get on here with Sheffield United. Oh, managerial masterclass. A draw against United, a close loss to Liverpool and then a win against West Ham. Not bad, but I think, yeah, we were getting relegated either way. So my squad at Luton Town did get 25 points. That... I want to say comfortably puts them maybe in the bottom 10 results for promoted sides. You know, if you look back to, was it Derby that got, I think it was 13 points or even worse? Like, it does happen. And I don't think 25 is that bad. But of course, we do need to check out how the players have got on. So top scorer, Salah. Are we going to have anyone in here? Adebayo. Made it to 13 goals. That's not bad. I'm quite impressed. And Dewsbury Hall got six assists. Interesting. Okay. 
Uh, if I go into team stats, we can have a little bit of a closer look here. Luton Town. So, Dewsbury Hill got the most appearances. I'm still gutted that... Look, we brought in a better goalkeeper, yet Matt Macy got more appearances. What happened? Oh, hang on. Oh. I think Carius asked to leave. I think they called him back. Oh, dear. Top scorer is, of course, going to be Adebayo. We've got seven from Woodrow. Alex Scott, though. Take a bow. What a, what a player. Seven goals, four assists. Very, very decent. Dewsbury Hall does, does seem to be a bit of a difference maker for us, at least in the second half of the season. But like I said, unfortunately, we were unable to, uh, to keep the job and we weren't able to keep them in the Premier League. But let me know if you enjoyed this, if you want me to do like another 10 minute transfer window madness thing. I think I've done this before a couple of years ago. It's fun. It's just it. It's very difficult. As soon as you hit that timer, your mind just goes blank. So it's kind of fun. Thank you guys for watching and I, I will see you in the next video. I don't know if it will be a transfer one or if it will be another one like this.